Do you guys remember about a mm, little less than a year ago? I used to consist a little bit before before a little less than a year ago. I used to consistently wear something that marked the bond between me and someone who is now one of my worst exes I've ever had. Well, the fact of the matter is I bought what I wore. Both versions. But the reason I wore both is because this ex pretty much refused to wear them and was not very appreciative of the idea, even though the gemstone on them was her favorite. Since then, as much as I have wanted to, I have not bought necklaces like that. However, recently, there's been something a little bit different in motion. This necklace has the same concept, except this time, I know it's a bit more concrete. I was making sure whatever was holding my shirt up wasn't in the way. Anyway, how's it going, everyone? My name is Dave, and welcome to another video. Unlike the necklaces, that I wore back then, this is going to be a permanent for me. Amber was very, very sweet to buy a pair of necklaces. One has half a heart, this one, and the other has the other. The necklaces together say better together. And honestly, I don't think that's inaccurate. My phone went off for something, hold on. Okay, ironically, that was actually Amber. And it was a response to what I was actually going to talk about today. I think just bringing up this necklace, first of all, extremely sweet gesture from her. I am definitely going to be wearing this the rest of my life because it's very, it's that meaningful to me. To be honest, I'm actually holding back quite a few tears from something that recently happened. Something that happened to her. By now, I'm pretty sure I've talked about it before, but I'm the kind of person who takes the pain off of those I care about, and I will exert some of it on myself. Nobody likes this. I know this for a fact, but it's very effective. Recently, The one who wears the other side of this, Amber, she's been going through a lot. That's more what this video is going to be about. I wasn't intentionally, I wasn't going to intentionally make it about that, but I'm going to connect it to this in some way, because it's mainly about this. This bow, this necklace, when Amber received it, when Pink Fox got it, and gave this half to me bound our hearts together to me T to me that bound us together pretty much permanently and whenever her heart is hurt I can always feel it in mine either right before it happens or as it's happening in fact I have her on uh, messenger on the side. That little cut from earlier, it's because I had to respond to it, and 
with what was going on recently. So let me go ahead and get to that. I'll get back to this right after I explain the situation. So Amber keeps in touch with many of her exes, hoping, like I've tried in the past, I have failed. But for her, she's hoped to at least keep friendships built, which is a very hard thing to do with relationships. Many know the stereotype that basically goes, when a breakup happens, both hate each other. This is a stereotype, but it's actually based off how most people respond. One of the exes that Pink Fox had gotten over, and it was the most recent one before me, she tries to, she has tried to keep in touch with them quite a bit, but this particular person has really only played the guilt card on her, and in a sense where it's like, feel bad for me kind of thing, which is a horrible thing to do. Amber got a hold of me, and she was breaking apart. I'm not going to go too much into detail about this. That's how sensitive this topic is. But needless to say, in the long run, I believe I took about 45 minutes. I don't know the exact amount of time, but 45 minutes to an hour. I stepped out. I was hanging out with Aaron at the time, Aaron Pittman. Um, you can check him out on some of the videos on this channel. But I stepped aside to, while, while he was actually, he was actually playing um, Mega Man X4 on my Switch. I'm on the collections that I have, and I when I stepped I, I stepped out let, while he was doing that to talk with Pink Fox to try to ease her mind, and as I was talking to her, I started to feel the kind of pain that she was receiving from all this, the kind of impact that this ex of hers was causing. That just wasn't okay for me. I stayed calm as much as I was starting to hurt as well. And I, well, <laughs> I just did what I could. Maybe it wasn't very much, but nonetheless, it at least eased her mind a little bit. That's how much something like this means to me. It's something she's done for me constantly as well. I go through a different category of crap. But for every little thing, that big heart of hers has been there to help lift me up. In my past, I have struggled to believe that I'd ever get anywhere. Then this angel of a woman comes along and, you know, proves me otherwise. And giving this to me only em emphasized on that even more. She wears the other half, and I'll always wear this half. This necklace, this time, is more of a symbol of how much that bond how realistic that bond between her and I actually 
is I'm on the verge of tears at this point, but that's... Before I do start bawling on camera, um, <laughs> I am going to leave this video here. For all of you who stuck around for this entire video, thank you. I really do appreciate everyone. Everyone here. The next milestone video I'm going to probably do is 200, and hopefully we hit that soon. Looks like we climbed too fast for me to even comprehend 10, because as of this recording, we're at 70, so... Meh. Short little thank you for that, though. One way or the other, thanks again for watching this video, guys. Want to check out any content that's more about me or discussion rants kind of like this one? I guess this one kind of fits under both, so, but links to both of those plays will be on the sides of my head. Below my head, or on the chin and below, will be a link to my channel if you want to check that out, or it'll also be in, that link will also be in the description below. In the meantime, though, I'm going to head off. Thanks again for watching this video, guys. Hope to catch you all in another one, though. Bye for now.